My name is Daniel Havanek. I'm from Scottsdale, Pennsylvania. It's a small town kind of surrounded by farmlands in Pennsylvania. Um, I'm a wood science and technology student at WVU. Uh, I expect to graduate in May 2013. I chose to come to WVU because I've always loved the school. Um, I've always wanted to be a part of the drum line. That was a big part of it. And I've known alumni and I've been down here. I had come down here through high school and I just love the atmosphere. I love the school. Um, I chose wood science and technology because after getting information on the program, it's something I could see myself doing. It's more hands-on than a lot of things and it's just got so many opportunities for you after you graduate. Um, I'm getting a minor in forestry resource management. I chose that minor because I feel that as a wood science and technology student um, and eventually professional, being able to understand the resource we're using and where it's coming from is very important. I think the best part about the wood science program is that it's so small, you get to form these relationships with the faculty and the other students. Uh, you don't become a faceless part of some larger organization. Everybody knows you and you know everybody. And you can go into any um, professor's office and talk about whatever you need to, whether it's class related or not. So uh, it's really what I like about the program. Um, during my time at WVU, I've gotten the chance to take some really interesting classes. Some of my favorites so far have been um, wood identification and structure. That's a really interesting class, I think because you just don't realize how many different types of commercial wood there are and their uses. And being able to identify them, I think, is really cool. It's not something most people can do. Dendrology was another really interesting class. Um, again, you just don't realize the huge scope of it, how many different kinds of trees there are, and how important it is to be able to identify them, especially in this field. Um, I'm also taking a sustainable construction class right now. I think that is just incredibly interesting. Um, we're learning how to build houses, mainly residential construction, but we're also focusing on the sustainable aspect of it, using green materials and green building practices. This summer, I'm going to be working with a few professors in the wood science program, and we're actually, they're developing a engineered wood product, and I'm going to be helping them with that. Um, this summer, I also expect to get some experience in the construction industry as well. Some of my hobbies include fishing and hunting. Um, uh, as far as WV organizations, I'm a member of the Drumline and the WV Marching Band, the Pride of West Virginia. Um, and around here, I'm a member of Z Sigma Pi, it's the National Honors Fraternity for the Forestry Students. Um, it's pretty time consuming. Marching band is really, really time consuming. You really have to learn to balance your time as a student, but it's really been beneficial to learn to balance your time and time management. For 2011 and 2012, I was recently awarded a scholarship through uh, the Weyerhaeuser Corporation for being a wood science technology student. Uh, my advice to future students would just to be open to new things and to try new things. Uh, in high school, if you would have told me that I was going to be in any program with science in the title, I would not have believed you. But um, after getting into the wood science program, I absolutely love it. You just have to be open to new experiences.